Gina um, to come forward and just to say a word about Gina. She is uh, a professor of writing at Corbin University. She's a novelist. She has, how many novels have you written? Five? Five. Five novels. Several of them have won major awards. Gina is a brilliant writer. And she also writes essays. So we read her essay, A Pilgrim in Progress. And would you just read this one scene for us? Yes. What is the meaning of life? What is the answer? Tell me. A man demanded at a recent reading. I looked longingly at the exit. Two elderly women in fold-out chairs leaned forward slightly. I was trapped. Well, it's the pursuit of truth, I murmured. Well, have you found it? His tone was combative, and in a different context, I might have laid all my cards out on the table, recited the Nicene Creed, told him the reason why I even breathe or want to keep breathing is because of Jesus. But I've learned to be cautious at public libraries. I deployed another smile that unfolded like a mechanical umbrella. Tell me, he insisted. Too short. Isn't that wonderful? Do you hear the details in that, that especially that last metaphor, that, 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 uh, like a mechanical umbrella, if we could just see that. So you're there, right? In the very uncomfortable moment with Gina as she's being pursued uh, uh, by this, by this um, listener uh, in the bookstore. So the writing is alive, isn't it? If you want the bones of your past to come alive on the page for you and for your reader, you're going to need scenes. Scenes root us in real time, real place, with real people and real action. More than half of the Gospels are scenes. God wanted us, when we read his word, to feel like we were there, like we were there with Jesus, right? Like we were there with the disciples. We are inviting the reader in to see and experience what we saw and experienced. And that's accomplished mostly through scenes. Scenes show, they don't tell. I'm not telling you what I'm feeling. I'm showing you what's happening. and I'm let, letting you feel what I'm feeling. See the difference? See how much closer that is, how much more immediate that is. Okay, so take out that little, that little blurb I asked you to write a few minutes ago. Take that out. I was really hinting heavily. I didn't want you to write it in a scene yet. Um, but I, So read what you wrote. Now go back to that moment and go back to that event. Now render that as scene. Okay, render it as scene. Let it unfold. Bring the reader into that moment. Okay. 